Sora! Don't let him get away! <sighs> What's going on? Can't believe it! That stupid peddler let Jafar out of the lamp! Jafar! <laughs> Give me the magic lamp, Anatom! And now, street rats, I bid you farewell! Crush those urchins! <laughs> <laughs> There's got to be a way. Ah, oh, come on, come kid. On, kid. That's an easy one. Easy one. Ow, oh, buddy, oh, pal. This is what having a genie for a best friend is all about. I mean, how can you leave me on the sidelines at a time like this? Live large. Follow hell. Give the old razzmatazz. What do you say, kid? Hey, genie. Sora. Want to see a little something I call sandstorm sweep? Oh, Take it away, Genie. Alakazam! Uh, you know, one lousy sandstorm is just too easy. Challenge next time, eh, Al? Now what do we do? Nice timing, Carpet. Up, Jafar. You sure this is it? Yeah, yeah. You gotta understand, it wasn't my idea. It was Jafar. He made me bring you here. You don't know him like I do. He can be very convincing. He said if I didn't cooperate, he was gonna... Where is he? Come on, Al, you gotta forgive me. Where's Jafar? Well, uh, let's see. Right about now, he's probably attacking the palace. I had no choice. His eyes, they got all creepy and weird. Whatever. Iago, you're supposed to be our friend. But you've been playing both sides, just to make sure you save yourself. I knew you were still a bad guy. I'm sorry!
Get some rest, Carpet. You earned it. Come on, let's get you far! And who asked you? The palace is through there. Hurry! Just wait, Jafar. You'll get exactly what's coming to you. Indeed I will, princess. All of Agrabah will belong to me, while you... <laughs> you, my queen, shall weep at my side for all eternity. Oh, please. <sighs> right about now, your precious Aladdin is whispering your name with his last breath. Hmm? Ah. What was that you were saying, Jafar? You dare defy me, you useless bird! <gasps> Ow! Iago! You'll all be joining him very soon! Don't mess with street rats. You went mano a mano with Jafar and you didn't invite me, El? Sorry, Genie. Things happen kind of fast. And I had some new moves to show off, too. Now, Genie, you still need your help. Who's gonna fix Agrabah? Oh, yeah! Well, Super Duper spruced up Agrabah coming right up. You won't even recognize the place when I'm through with it. Just like it was, please. Really? Same old, same old. All right. Voila! Next time, let me put in a few swimming pools, okay? <sighs> I guess Agrabah's all right now. Yeah, thanks, guys. Hey, you behave yourself. Got it? I most definitely got it. No more looking out for number one. I'm reformed! I want to be a good friend like Genie, but I can't do anything to help you. What kind of a friend is that? Oh, no. It's not like that, Iago. Friends don't have to do stuff. As long as you have fun hanging out together, that's all that matters. So, what do you guys do for fun? We do this. Uh, that's not quite what I meant. Well, anyway... Ow, my feet! Gorsh, Iago. I hope you didn't hurt yourself. Well, <laughs> at least I can still fly. Look out! Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. oh! Was that my cue? Am I on? Come on, Al. Let me build a freeway or something. Uh, everything's fine. Don't panic. Genie? But I can't hold it any longer! Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's good! <laughs> Sora, Donald, Goofy, you guys are too much. If you're ever in the mood for some more cosmic razzle-dazzle, give me a shout, okay? You got it! Well, you've done it again, Sora. Don't forget about us, okay? I won't. And Sora, 
about that friend of yours, the one you're looking for? You'll find him. Trust me. Nothing wrong with my design. It's flawless. There must be something wrong with the parts those imbeciles brought me. I need to find better assistance. Timing, gentlemen. Lend me a hand, won't you? These presents must belong to Sandy Claus, so I thought I'd better return them. You just happened to find them? Of course, Sora. I'm finished with Christmas fantasies, you know that. He thought you'd hold on to the suit. What, this? It's just a costume. And Sally worked so very hard making it. Come on, we've got work to do. Did you find these? In Halloween Town. You'll be needing them for Christmas, right, Sandy? Of course. But these are just a few of the Christmas presents that were stolen. Stolen? Oh, Sandy, you don't think it was me? Still wearing the outfit, I see. I just thought I'd dress for the occasion. But, if you don't believe me, then we'll just have to find out who really did it. Very well, I'll leave it to you. All right, Sora, Donald, Goofy, we're off! Looks good. No! Boring! This one? No! No way! Kill! So you three took them. Took what? You stole the presents, didn't you? It wasn't us. But... It really sounds like fun! Run, Run for, for it! it! Thank you. 
You can't be here. Leave Halloween Town by order of the mayor. Somebody, anybody, I'm only an elected official. I can't handle this by myself. Sally was right. We've got to get the presents. What a shame. It looks like it was such a nice present. Uh, Jack. Oh, help! Someone help me! My latest experiment is gone! It's been stolen! Not quite. There's more? Don't worry, I'll take care of the rest. Did you finish making the presents? Yep, just waiting for Jack. So, uh, where do you think we ought to leave them? Hmm. Oh, I know a good spot. Whenever you're ready, just say the word. I'm back. This plaza should work well for your plan. Now, Jack, what is your plan? I've got it all figured out. You do? Of course. And I also have a wonderful idea. If we catch the thief for you, I would be honored to deliver the crew. And on that note, we'll be going. What are you doing? Let me go! It's not me, Donald. Patience, friends. Shh. I found out. Gorge, was that you? How come we have to be the bait? Good plan, eh? Ouch! Dr. Finkelstein's experiment did it! We did it! The mystery is solved! Did you catch the thief? Naturally. I just can't figure out why the doctor's experiment would go around stealing Christmas presents. His experiment? The thief. It was a moving puppet made by Dr. Finkelstein. Hmm, the doctor has made a moving puppet. I see. He is always tinkering with things. 
Now listen, Jack. I'd like to thank you, and while delivering presents is something only I can do, I can give you an idea of what it's like. Sandy Claus? Yes, all that poor puppet wanted was a heart. Ho, ho, ho! Interesting. So the puppet wasn't stolen after all. It ran away on its own. In other words, my experiment was an overwhelming success. Santa Claus thinks maybe it left because it was trying to find a heart. That's quite possible. Unlike my Sally, it wasn't equipped with a heart. But if it wanted a heart, why was it going around stealing all those Christmas presents? Maybe because presents are a way to give your heart to someone special. Hmm. When you put it that way, I feel sort of bad for it. Happy Halloween! What a nice present. I don't understand. There's no box. No ribbon tied in a bow. Jack, it's not about the box or the ribbons. It's about what's inside the box. No, Sora. What really counts, what's really special, is the act of giving the gift. To wish deep in your heart to make someone else happy. Right. Of course. Thank you, Sally. You're absolutely right. Wait. What's this? I feel so strange. So very happy. Jack, that must be Sally's present. Really? This wonderful feeling? Oh, Sally. You've given me the nicest present in the world. And I've nothing to give you in return. What would you like? Just name it. Absolutely anything. The nicest present I could ever ask for, Jack, is just to be with you. You don't even have to ask for that. Oh! Uh. Maybe I never gave her a real present after all. Oh, I bet Kyrie would like most anything you gave her. I know. That's what made it so hard to decide. It's not the gift, it's what's in your heart. My heart. You bet. Diamonds won't settle. How? Well, as long as she can be with you, what else does she need? It's you guys. Man, we were hoping you were a meal. Hiya. Don't give me any of that Hiya stuff. Thanks to you clowns, we're back to scavenging scraps for a living. <laughs> Come on, it's not that bad. I enjoyed that weak dead elephant we had yesterday. Hey, how's Simba? <laughs> <laughs> we gotta laugh every time we hear that dude's name. <laughs> Ooh. Say it again. Simba. <laughs> One more time. Simba. <laughs> Simba. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> That's enough. Go on then. See for yourself. Simba is one wishy-washy king. Yeah, I bet about now even some of those high and mighty lionesses were wishing they'd gotten themselves a different king. Gorge, what do you think could have happened? Well, let's go find Simba and see. Scar? Huh? I'm yours? We better tell Simba about this. Wonder if he's up there. You came back. Are you okay? You don't look so good. Hey Simba, why don't we team up and do something about that Scar Ghost? Seems like everybody's worried about it. So, now's your big chance to show him what you're really made of. That doesn't concern you. Sorry. It's okay. I just wish I knew what my father would do. But he's not here, Simba. It's all up to you now. And that means the important thing is what you're gonna do being the king, not what your father would have done. So you're saying it's all up to me? See? There you go. Hey, yep, Jack up. up! We know your dad was a great king and all, but now it's your turn. Remember what I taught you. You gotta put the past behind you. It's time to go out there and show everybody things are gonna be just fine. Yeah, you can do it. You gotta live for today. And find your own path. Live for today. And find my own path. Not my father's. That's it. I'm glad to hear you say that, Simba. <laughs> Promise me you'll help Simba any way you can. As long as Sora handles a dangerous part. I'm counting on you, Simba. And so is our baby. <laughs> Great, now we're gonna have to babysit. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go see Rafiki first. I'm sure he'll be able to tell us something about that ghost. Just leave us alone. Do you three know anything about Scar's ghost? Huh? Scar's ghost? <laughs> Maybe. You do know. Oh no! I guess you caught us all. What are we gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about Scar's ghost. Sorry, we don't know nothing. Oh, wait. It's coming back to me. That's the one that only hangs out around Freddy Cats. Right, Banzai? Enough! <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Must be a Freddy Cat around here somewhere. 
Simba, do something! How does it feel to be king? Hmm? Why, you must be a truly inspiring leader by now. After all, you are the son of the great Mufasa. Where are you going? Ah, Simba, running away as always. Simba! <laughs> Gorge, Rafiki was right. You mean Simba's still unsure? Seems like. Do you think there's some way we can help? Hmm. We should start by talking to Simba some more. Let's head back to the Pride Lands. Father. Hmm, it seems even your daddy has abandoned you. How sad. Simba! It's no use. I'll never be the king my father was. But Simba, that's not what you're supposed to be. You can't be Mufasa. You can only be you. Everybody believes in you as a king. They just want to see what you'll do. And if anyone's saying they liked your father better, it's because you haven't done much yet. That's all. I know that. Then stop moping and do something. I can't. Fine. Let's go, Sora. Yeah. Why stick around if he's not even gonna try? Come on, Goofy. <sighs> the hesitant king will one day lose all his friends. King Simba the Dagger. Worried by a silly old ghost. Ooh, Simba, the do-nothing king. No! Try and stop me. <sighs> you did it! The ghost is gone! We knew you could do it! Hooray for Simba! You know, I'm really lucky to have friends who stand by me and help me see clearly. My father wasn't so fortunate. There you go again. I mean, everyone here and in the Pride Land wants me to succeed. Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Pumba, Timon, Rafiki, Nala. You all want what's best for me. But my father always had Scar lurking behind his back, trying to cut him down. I've got to make the most of my blessings and rebuild this kingdom. Are you gonna say it or do it? Wait and see. <laughs> Simba, come quick! There's a bazillion ghosts of Scar haunting the Pride Lands! Everybody but Nala hightailed it out of there, and now she needs your help! Uh... Our little Simba, all grown up and finding his place in the world. Nice try, you're coming too! I've come back, Nala.
Get out. Way to go, Simba! Are you with me? Now and forever, your majesty. Simba seems fine now. Ha! The king has returned. The Pride Lands will not forget King Simba's courage, or the courage of those who fought beside him. Do you think your quest will ever be over? I don't know. But I think, as long as the Keyblade stays with me, I'll have to keep fighting. Ah, the struggle never ends. That is the great circle of life. Never ever? The secret to victory is a strong heart. Go on, go on, go, go then! <laughs> go on, get out! Yes, yes, it is time! Your fight continues! Till we meet again, your majesty. I hope that's soon. It will be. So long. Wait a sec. I thought everything was supposed to be under control here. Must be Organization 13 again. We better go see Leon. He went on over to Ansem's study to find out what all the ruckus was about. Turns out the MCP is using the data in that computer to crank out Heartless. The MCP's been messing around with the town's control system, too.
That MCP sure doesn't know when to quit, does it? Be there soon, Tron. Tron's okay. Me too. Let's head for the game grid. Great. The terminal works. Let's go! Finished? Would be. If it weren't for the old loon's magic. Old loon, you say? I'm trying to work here. <laughs> I'll show you who's old. Done. Yeah! There you go, Leon. One homemade program. A loony wizard special. This had better work. I'm off. Be on your guard. Warning. User control is terminated indefinitely. <sighs> no good. Leon, let me try. This is your final warning. Stop at once. Bon appétit. 
Don't talk with your mouth full. What? What are you loading? Nothing's come in yet. Leon! Come on! There! All right! What's it like? This is very strange. That's my spy truck! Huh? There's a power booster for me. And flight routines for the solar sailor. Meaning we're set? Well, like you users say, we won't know till we give it a try. We'll need a sailor to reach the MCP, so let's get to the simulation hangar. Got to keep a lookout. The MCP isn't going to just let us waltz in. The MCP is straight ahead. Time to settle things for good. Precious little bugs, your time is up! Prepare for de-resolution! You're very persistent, Tron. I'm also better than you. Uh, we would have made a great team. Now for the MCP. This thing is the MCP? That's it. Ugly, isn't it? Tron, don't you understand? We don't need users. We've advanced. They're superfluous. Be a part of me, and together the world will be ours to control. MCP. You still don't get it, do you? Sark! 
Sark! All my functions are now yours! I see Tron has a silly side, too. I learned it from you. Of course, I do have my silly limits. Okay, then I'll tweak your program when I get back to the user world. You? Maybe we better not try that. Aw, oh, how about it, guys? Sing in Tron, dance in Tron. Sound good? <laughs> okay, okay, fine. But before I crash... Sora, Donald, Goofy, and all the users out there... Thank you. You really helped me. You made me so much stronger. You taught me what friendship is truly all about. And I'll never forget it. As soon as I met you, I knew we were going to defeat the MCP and free the system. Isn't this what users do when they're sorry to say goodbye? Uh, it's a first for me. Gorge, Tron, it's like a promise that we'll see each other again real soon. Okay, well then. I promise. Where are you going? Oh. <laughs> Tron! Things are settling down in town! The only Heartless left anywhere are the local variety. And it looks like there are fewer than before. Now if we can just get those three back in one piece... You're here! Welcome back! How's the town? A-OK! -okay. Not a single trace of the MCP, either. Everything's back to normal. We made it. Hey, why the long face? What happened? Tron just disappeared. And he promised we'd see him again. Run! What's happening? Greetings, friends. System is up and ready for user input. Tron! Tron! Stay in touch. Yeah. And bring up Tron! Hey, stop that! It tickles! Tron is ticklish? How about this? Please, stop that! <laughs> <laughs> I think Tron's been hanging around those guys too much. Wait, wait, just a moment. I want to show you something I dug up from the system archives. You can see the town back when it was first built. That's right. 
I remember now. Just like the old days. Hmm. I'd be fascinated to ascertain as to when the town got such a dreadful name as Hollow Bastion. Another name once. Hmm? Radiant Garden. 